Hey guys, so today I thought I'd talk about nine secret winning skincare products you're sleeping on that you don't know exist. And I'm gonna tell you what you should check out and maybe why it's worth giving it a try. So, uh, and a lot of these are products that I haven't seen get a lot of talk or chat or reviews yet. So uh, a few of them might be newer, so maybe that's why. But anyway, first up, uh, Pacifica, they are so hit or miss. I, I can't make heads or tails of this brand, but they have some winning lines. And this Future Youth line that they came out with is also hit or miss. So they've got a serum, which uh, contains fragrance. Not terribly strong, but it's in there. Uh, and then they have this eye serum from this lineup. And this uh, has no scent. It has vanilla in there, I believe. Uh, but it's really nice. And it's $22. And the bottle is 0.67 ounces. And it's a really nice eye serum. And I'm very picky about my eye products because I love, I have one I love, which is the Isentree Snail uh, Peptide Eye Cream uh, Eye Serum, which is lovely and very affordable and large bottle. But this stuff is really nice. Uh, so it's really hydrating. It's got aloe. It's got several peptides in there, strawberry, ectoin, several different ferments, including black, black tea ferment, vanilla extract, uh, rice extract. It's really lovely, and it really works well on my, around my eyes, on my eyelids, around my eyebrows, and it feels super nice, and I really enjoy it. And it's $22, and a little bit of this one goes a long way. And the packaging, it's really cute, too, I have to admit. I, I'm, I'm totally not terribly into packaging, but... When it's cute, it works. I mean, look at what Drunk Elephant did with their fun packaging. They've got 10-year-olds that want to use retinoids and exfoliants because of their packaging. So packaging does do something. So this stuff is really lovely. So worth checking out in my humble opinion. Next up, so a few of you mentioned this one to me. And it's the Gold Bond Angel Renew Retinol Overnight Body and Face Lotion. Ike is entering the room again. It's hot out. I was outside for like 10 minutes. And it's really hot today. Anyway, so he likes to sit in the bathtub when it's this hot out. I don't know why, but anyway. So this one's $13. It's gigantic. It's 7 ounces. And it's a really nice product. And it does work, work well body and face. I typically use this more on my body because I'm using other retinoids on my face. But it's really nice. Shea butter, retinol, vitamin E, cocoa, lentil, squalane, peptides. It's very hydrating. My cap kind of busted a little bit on it, but... Uh, it's got a very thick texture to it, which is nice, and it really works well over just your body or uh, wherever you want some anti-aging benefits, face, back of your hands, but be sure to use sunscreen because uh, otherwise the benefits will be gone uh, within the next day you get sun exposure. So anyway, it's very nice, very hydrating, no scent to it, and the bottle's gigantic. And Gold Bond is also a nice, affordable, cruelty-free brand made by Sanofi. Uh, anyway, in Chattanooga. Chattanooga, Tennessee. Okay, so this stuff worth checking out, especially if you're in for a nice bargain or just a really nice hydrating body lotion with a little bit of extra benefits, go for it. Although I will really fire this up in the winter when I'm not out in the sun quite as much because I'm out in the sun walking, exercising, things like that. Okay, next up, I think this is probably the most expensive one on the list, but it's really quite nice. And uh, anyway... How much 45 milligram milliliters so it's a little bit bigger than the average uh, bottle it's the round lab dope dope ampule for about 30 dollars unless you get on sale which is an even better deal but uh let me do a little uh, swatch of it because it's just a really nice uh textured ampule you can use it kind of after your toner or essences and it's really nice and hydrating it fits into my routine really easily without me having to change too much or mess around with it and it really does layer well under other products or thicker moisturizers things like that it's really nice so in here we've got uh, hydrolyzed collagen which is great for hydrating your skin we've got betaine another great humectant licorice root extract great for brightening antioxidant soothing and then we've got ceramides in here so this stuff's really nice uh the dokdo line I, I really love this line their sunscreen's great it's right there the cleansing oil is wonderful uh, the toner is great. It's a really, it's a winning line from Realm Lab in my opinion. So check this one out if you haven't, or check this line out. The sunscreen from this line is great too. Okay, next up. So I picked this one up a while ago, and I don't think I've reviewed it yet. I'm not sure why. Maybe I have. I'm going to have to check. But if not, this one deserves some attention. And uh, it doesn't get mentioned a ton, but it's a really amazing product. And it comes in at $15, and that's the Gray Melon Astaxanthin Serum uh, for $15, and this bottle is 50 milliliters, so a normal bottle is 
30 milliliters, so this is almost double, 1.7 ounces. And this stuff is really nice too. It's got a very nice texture to it and really works well in my routine and contains some other exciting ingredients aside from astaxanthin. I don't really know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but okay, here it is right here. There we go. Okay, so in here we've got aloe, we've got the star ingredient, astaxanthin, adenosine, cell communicate ingredient, licorice root, olantlin, olive oil, squalane, ceramides. It is a bargain for $15. And it's just a really wonderful product with some nice ingredients in there, cell communicate ingredients, antioxidants, hydrating ingredients, uh, and no scent to it, which is also great and really, really affordable. So wonderful for uh, just helping with wrinkles, fine lines, things like that. Axithin is a great, strong, powerful antioxidant that's really good for your skin. So really enjoy that stuff. Next up, so this one's a good product for most people with the exception of acne prone skin or milia prone skin. And that is the Future Wise Slug Cream Barrier Moisturizer. It retails for $24. So it is not friendly for acne prone skin or milia prone skin at all. So I don't recommend it for those, but for very dry skin, uh, barrier damage, hydrating, things like that, it's a really wonderful product. Uh, and it's super hydrating. It's got a lot. This this one I think has three products so far, so it's a newer brand. Let me, I'll just do a little. There we go, right there. It's a newer brand, so I will link to them below. They've got, I think so far, three or four products now, and maybe they'll come out with more, maybe not. We'll see. So in here we've got phytosterols, which are great for hydrating and barrier repairing. We've got a peptide, evening primrose oil, and then uh, vitamin E as well. So very hydrating. You can use this at the end of your routine in the evening, or if your skin is very dry or damaged, you can certainly use it in the daytime, but it's pretty thick, can be a little suffocating. Uh, so only use it at, at the end of your routine because it will help seal everything in and uh, help hydrate skin and prevent transepidermal water loss as you sleep. Uh, I can envision myself using this perhaps in the daytime during the dry winter when it gets super dry, super cold, and uh, my skin is dry, peeling, angry, flaking, red, irritated, everything else. I can, uh, this did, brand didn't come up until recently, or I hadn't been aware of it. So uh, we'll give it a real test this winter and see how it does during the daytime then. But uh, up until then, it's worth giving a try to. Okay, I got a few, handful more. Next up, I've got the Jumiso Snail Peptide 95 Essence for $21. So this one's a newer product, so I've been just playing around with it for the last uh, few weeks, so not enough time to give it a full review, but so far I'm really impressed with it. It encompasses the nice things I really like about snail mucin and encompasses those with some other good ingredients. It's got a really nice jelly texture to it. So here we go. Da -da -da. Very hydrating and very wonderful. Actually, now that I think about it, I should do a versus of this in the Casa Rex Essence because they share a lot of the same features, uh, with the exception. So this one contains snail secretion filtrate, elantlin. It contains peptides, of course. It also contains copper peptides, which I love. They're very fussy ingredient, but uh, probably a very low amount since the product is clear, but uh, worth trying because of those peptides and snail mucin and no fragrance. And it's just really wonderful and very affordable. This bottle is gigantic as well, 4.73 ounces. So... If you're interested in seeing a verses of this one in the Casarex, let me know. And Jumiso will come up one more time in a minute. Okay, next up, I've got the, and I've reviewed this, I've talked about it a few times, but I hope more people try it because it really is lovely. The Neogen High R Exosome Cream retails at about $17, although it's on sale a lot, so that might be worth checking out. This stuff is a winner, so when I went up to the cabin, Last weekend, or the last few times, I've had to pick a moisturizer, and a lot of them come in bulky containers, and I don't want to repot re them or whatever. And this one's just easy because it comes in a little squeeze tube, and it's so handy, and it's super hydrating. So let me see. We're running out of room here. Okay, here we go. There we go. Super moisturizing. I really like the packaging because not enough moisturizers come in squeeze tubes in my opinion. But this stuff is really hydrating. You can use it in morning or evening routine. So far I use it most of the time in my evening evening routine. But again, this coming winter, perhaps that will change. 
So in here, we've got a long list of really good ingredients. We've got niacinamide, cocoa extract, centella asiatica, ascorbic acid, resveratrol, amino acids, peptides, and copper peptides. This product is amazing. If you haven't checked it out, do some digging on it. It's really lovely. I think it's also a nice hydrating dupe for the Drunk Elephant Proteiny. So if you're currently into that, this one might be a nice alternative. And it's so much more affordable for the same size. It's, what, 50 bucks less? Did they just raise the price on that? Because last time I was looking at it online, it looked more expensive. But anyway. Okay, two more. Next up, the Numbazin number one purple complex soothing moisture cream. Numbazin is more known for their toner, which a lot of people love. Um, where is it? Well, I thought it was handy, but it's not. Okay. This stuff from them is great. They also have a sunscreen, which I love, and a lot of other products, which I love. This stuff is really nice. If you have oily or acne-prone skin, I recommend checking this one out because it's very friendly. It's kind of made geared towards that skin type, and it's got some really nice ingredients in here. There we go. I'm running out of room. <laughs> anyway, I'll be down to my feet in a second. So, okay, there we go. Very nice hydrating formula. Retails for $20, and the tube is 3.38 ounces. Uh, so in here we've got chamomile, azulene, some great soothing ingredients, neem extract, eggplant, turmeric, blueberry, and centella. It doesn't get much better than that. It has no scent. This stuff is amazing, and I love it. And it's really impressive from this lineup, and they've got some other goodies worth checking out, including that sunscreen. really enjoy that. Okay, last but not least, one more product from Jumiso. Their Awesun Airy Fit Sunscreen, uh, SPF 50, and it retails for $15, and it's really nice. I'm wearing it right now underneath the Dr. Jar BB Cream. It's really wonderful texture of this stuff. It's a chemical sunscreen. Here we go. And I heard about this lineup from Matt, so I give him a shout out, but it's really wonderful because it absorbs really quickly. It's got five chemical filters. It's got uh, PA of four pluses, which indicates great uh, UVA protection. Uh, so aside from those five filters, we've got bamboo, which is really nice and hydrating. We've got panthenol, vitamin E. It's fragrance free. And think about the bamboo makes me think of keep cool. And I don't know, does that brand still exist or not after all the stuff they did? I don't know. I'll have to check. I don't really care. But anyway, this stuff is really wonderful. And I love finding a new chemical K-Beauty with some more exciting uh, ingredients in there. And it really is light feeling and really works well. So, liking it. So, anyway, those are my uh, nine secret products you're sleeping on. Interesting to hear from you if there's anything you have tried from this list and maybe you're not sleeping on them. But a lot of these are really affordable. And uh, I think there's something for everybody in here. We've got moisturizer, serums. Uh, sunscreens, eye products, moisturizers, retinol, astaxanthin, ampules, whatever. Everything. There we go. They're all winners. I love them all. They're all worth a try, in my opinion. So, interested in hearing from you, leave a comment, and I will see you guys more tomorrow. I'm going back out in the 100 degree weather to go for a walk, and I might regret this, but if I live, I'll have a video tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks so much. Okay, bye guys.